Hello Player Games, it is Charlie and welcome back to Central. Today we brainstorm yet another idea for a DLC. A popular well-known idea across the community would be Paris. Now, the first thing that would come into everyone's mind when you think of Paris would be the Eiffel Tower and I will come back to that shortly because I believe it will play a huge role in the map. However, most of the community will also think that the catacombs will link into play um, and I don't think this is going to happen. Not at all. Now, just hear me out here guys, if they do decide to bring out a Paris map, the catacombs will have no importance whatsoever. It will not be involved in the map and I know I've brought out a theory about this before but um, no, it, it's wrong, I've realised I'm wrong, um, every other YouTuber that says that a catacomb's going to be in Paris is wrong, please just rule that out, it's not going to happen. But moving on, um, going back a few years, Treyarch released some information about a Paris map, stating that they were thinking of giving us Paris instead of the Moon DLC for our final Zombies map in the Resurrection DLC on Black Ops. However, Moon was released and this gave the community an idea of what would be the first map in Black Ops 2 and those who thought it would be Paris were obviously wrong because we now have Green One. But on the other hand, who's to say that we won't get Paris as a DLC map? Now. I was thinking about it, and a pretty nice setting for the map would be um, to go back into the past, you know, 1945 to around the 1960s sort of time. Uh, following the decimation of the Earth, the map would also have that apocalyptic atmosphere to it. You know, fire everywhere and a red sky above the map, but the only problem with that is that it may be a bit too similar to Transit or Green Run, um, because it would look the same, you know, the same setting and that sort of stuff, so we'll just have to see what Treyarch do with that there. Um, but going back to the Eiffel Tower, now, the Eiffel Tower um, can play a major role in this map and this story because if you think if we think about transit and cast our minds back to the Easter egg, we had that pylon shooting the strange electricity or power up it. We now have this tower sitting in the middle of the map or at the end of the map or whatever. Um, this could be a great chance to sort of introduce the same sort of Easter egg and to boost this power up the Eiffel Tower. And because it's so big and well structured like that, um, this power may actually be able to shoot up and something else might actually happen to it. What if it sort of uh, diverts across the earth or something? You know, we just have to wait and see. But again, the only problem with that is that the Easter egg will be way too similar to the one in transit and a lot of people will probably moan about that because of the similarities um, so again side quests I really hope they change that again um, I don't really want the same one like I said but yeah Paris has been around for such a long time you know we cast our minds back to World at War when we first found the picture of the zombie in front of the Eiffel Tower uh, ideas start to sprout up from YouTube there you know loads of people were thinking of all these awesome theories and ideas um, even up until now people are still um, coming up with these ideas for Paris and it seems like it's going to happen because we know there was a Paris map we know it's certain because Treyarch said so uh, whether they've actually made it or not we don't know but we know that they have the idea still in their mind to make this map and I like to think that it is pretty certain we'll be receiving a Paris map because there's been so much talk about it and so many hints towards it um, that we're probably going to receive it but you know I've been around since uh, people have been coming up with ideas such as the pack up on should be at the top of the tower or the box will be at the top and things like that you know um, and it will be cool to actually receive this map and to actually see what they've actually done all these years um, what they've actually included in it um, but yeah you know uh, I hope you're also enjoying the song in the background at the moment just remember who brought this song out first uh, our beloved Ben obviously uh, this song did come out before any other moron brought out a theory online about it um, so yeah, that's pretty much what I've got to say about Paris, guys. Um, a DLC soon to come, perhaps so. Let me hear what you guys have to say about it. You know, there is a comment section down there. We'd love to see your opinions, ideas, and theories about it all. Um, it'd be awesome to see something from the community. And if you were sort of the veterans uh, back then when you saw the picture in Doris, let us know what you thought at the time as well. Um, but other than that, it's been Charlie, guys. Can't really say much else about Paris. Uh, would love it as a map, but yeah, make sure to subscribe, like the video, and I'll see you all soon. Goodbye. Oi, 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 oi.
oh, so, sorry, just before you go, uh, could you please remember to like the video? It's down the bottom somewhere. And also don't forget to subscribe. You can click the central button up here and it'll take you through to our webpage and top you can click. Subscribe and share the video with as many people as you can. And thank you for watching our Play the Game video!